Hi guys, this is Joyce Gangabert again. Uh, thank you for tuning in and um, I'm from Candy Travel on Candy Channel and on this video we are going to Masai Mara and we're going to try um, a different kind of hotel than we'd normally go to. Um, I have been, it comes with some good reviews so we're going to go try it out and on this trip I've got my mom who is coming with us as a treat um she's never been to Masai Mara so it's her first time I've got a friend from the UK who's traveling with us it's called Jed uh you will see very little of him he's camera shy but I've also got one of my best friends I've got five but I've got one of them um and her name is Esther you're going to see um you're going to see her on part two of the Masai Mara video and you'll see her on a few other videos um, in Mombasa um, in Nairobi so please stay tuned and I shall keep updating you as I go along thank you hi uh, we are here at Rironi Rironi Ruby's petrol station waiting for our tour guide and the rest of the cr uh, crew to uh, the rest of the group to arrive and pick us up uh, because it made sense instead of us going all the way to the city to get on the on the land cruise so we might as well as wait because we leave on our way to Masai Mara so we are here at Ruby's waiting for them to turn up and then from here we're just going to head on straight and oh wait I think that's our tour guide I see yes that's him so guys I shall keep you posted um see you in a bit bye bye Hiya, yeah, um, we are on the track now, we are just approaching the escarpment, the Rift Valley and as you can see the traffic here is um, bumper to bumper from what, we'll be, from what we're hearing from those ahead because we are part of a number of trucks, land cruisers just somewhere ahead of us and from what the driver has been told is that there's an accident, the car is overturned and has blocked the roads no cars going either way so um, our driver is going to turn back and we're going to go find an alternative route which from what i've heard is through a place called kijabe uh, cut through um rba um school and stay tuned and i shall keep you posted quite possibly when we get to masai Mara. thank you Hi guys, this is Joyce again and I'm sat here talking to um, Robbie, he works at the front office at Jumbo Mara. He's going to tell you a little bit about Jumbo Mara. He's not going to make it too long, we'll keep it short. Um, welcome. Well, I'm Robbie. Uh, I work at Jumbo Mara. For those who haven't been there, I would really like to welcome you. Uh, Jumbo is a lodge. It's a good place for your vacation and maybe for your holidays. We have view activity in the hotel, we yeah, have no, swimming pool, we, we have a gym, we have a pool table, and also have got a, a table tennis whereby when you're in the hotel, they're all on uh, a full boat. When you're paid the hotel, they're all complimentary for you. In Jumbo Mara, well, we have a team of staff who are really caring. I'm very sure they're going to make you happy for the day that maybe you'll be in the hotel so my I want just uh, to welcome you come and uh, visit in the place I'm very sure you'll get the best of your expectation thank you hi guys this is Joyce we're now at the Masai Mara we're at the hotel called Jumbo Mara Camp and I'm going to now show you the two different types of rooms one that has a twin bed twin beds and one that's got a double bed so follow me and I'll show you around So this is the room with twin beds. This in here, as you come in, to the left, you've got your toilet, and you've got your, it's nice and clean, you've got your sink, and we have been in overnight, because we came last night, it was too dark, that's your shower, 
and it's nice and clean it's got your rainfall shower um your little bin on that side and over there you've got your hair dryer on the left and in here you've got your twin beds um this room is for my mom and my best friend so mom's sleeping there and my sister my my best friend sleeping, sleeping there and they've looked after us they give you an extra blanket because it's quite cold at night and over there you've got some chairs you've got a kettle and you've got some tea making facilities or like we call it brew kit you've got a heater and don't mind the mess we've been here overnight and we're going to go in the morning we want to again drive you've got a lamp you've got two chairs and for those of you who film like i do vloggers you've got a desk you can put your laptop on that as you work and over here you've got a balcony beautiful absolutely beautiful some beautiful bougainvillea flowers to the back and on this side over here you've got an area so if you do wash your clothes you can wash them over hang them over there and now i'm going to take you to see now i'm going to take you to see the room with a double bed so follow me And this right here is uh, one of Team Candy. We've just come back from a game drive. He's just chilling with a cold tasker. Very cold tasker. And come in. And to the right, you've got your shower. Again, it's nice. Sorry. Again, it's nice and clean. You've got your sink on that side. You've got your hair dryer. You've got your shower. The toilet a little bin and wait for it right here you've got a weighing scale and in here behind this door you've got a wardrobe and then that's where they keep the spare blankets and they've got a gown they've got umbrellas there's a full-size mirror right there and if And if you come with me, that's your double bed. That's not a double bed to me. It's more like a house. I believe it's more like a very large king bed. And obviously it was cold, so I had the extra blanket on top. You've got your nice lounge chair right here at the bottom. And if you come with me, you, you provided a lamp. You've got one you want to one you want to work in the dark. You've got a fan if you're hot. And some brew making facilities, as you can see, we've already made some and had some. And don't mind all our luggage, we have been here since yesterday. And behind this curtain, is there's a patio. Spacious area, very serene. You can chill out after a long day's time. So, guys, I am now going to take you around Jambomara so that you can see how beautiful it looks. It's a good hotel, and for a budget hotel, this is absolutely amazing. So, stay tuned.
there. Hey, look, those hippos look like they're real. I kid you not, they look like the for real, right? I'm in a very cheeky mood. I'm going to go and fool around a little bit, see if I can get my head in the hippo's head. Um, maybe even my hand. Um, I'm just going to go mess about a bit. He's the chef at Jumbo Mara and he has been so good to us. He's looked after our mom who's elderly with diabetes. He comes and he asks mom what she wants. They sit down and go through the menu, the diet and packed a, a really good lunch for my mom. So next time you come, he is going to look after you. Are you going to say hello to my viewers? Just say hello. Hello. Karibu. Karibu sana. Yeah, thank you very much. Thank you.
guys thank you thank you for staying tuned i really appreciate that and if you do like what you've seen please press share with your friends and i shall see you on the next video thank you for watching